Hello and welcome to CNN News 18 with me Ayushman Singh Jamwal. Our top story as heavy rains hit North India. Now the Met Department has predicted that heavy rainfall will continue in Haryana, Uttar Pradesh, Rajasthan, Punjab, Chandigarh and the national capital. Several parts of the national capital remain waterlogged, ladies and gentlemen. For Himachal Pradesh, the Met Department has issued a red alert. Landslides and flash floods have blocked several roads in Shimla, Sirmaur, Lahore and Spiti, Chamba and the Solon districts. We're getting a piece of breaking news from the national capital. Now, heavy rains have led to water logging in the national capital. Khan market has been inundated. Now, Delhi Education Minister Atishi visited the rain-hit areas and pump houses in ITO to inspect the water logging situation. All Delhi schools will remain closed tomorrow. Atishi has ordered the inspection of all schools after a collapse in the East Kailash area. The Yamuna River is likely to breach the danger mark on the 11th of July. That's the piece of break news coming in from the national capital. Rain havoc in the national capital, ladies and gentlemen. Heavy rains have led to water logging in several parts of Delhi. Khan market is inundated. Delhi Education Minister, those visuals on the right side of your screen, visited the rain-hit areas and pump houses in ITO to inspect the water logging situation. All Delhi schools will remain closed Tomorrow, I'm joined by my colleague Yash, who's been tracking all the developments in the national capital, given the rain fury in Delhi. Yash, over to you. Right. I'm sorry, I'm joined by my colleague Akash on the phone line. Akash, uh, give us the details when it comes to the situation in the national uh, capital, when it comes to uh, the rain havoc that we are seeing. We see those visuals on the right side of our uh, screen. Uh, Atishi is reviewing the water hit areas. And now what we are learning is that all Delhi schools are closed tomorrow. Uh, what is the latest from Ground Zero? Right. Uh, so, Aishman, you see, uh, we are witnessing continuous uh, rain capital from... Uh, uh, the last uh, two days and hit and uh, uh, you know this is the reason why in fact uh, a lot of uh, areas are waterlogged at this point in time in fact uh, uh, these visuals are uh, the visuals of PW Minister, uh, pwd minister Atishi, uh, who is taking stock of the situation uh, in fact monitoring the situation from uh, various cctv cameras that are installed at the places where uh, the pumps are working and in fact where the pwd workers are working uh, you know, uh, to uh, uh, to just remove uh, the water from the areas. Also, it is important to mention, and as you rightly mentioned, that Arvind Kejriwal, Chief Minister of Delhi, has announced that tomorrow, on Monday, all the schools of the national capital will remain closed because of the situation. Also, Aishman, it is important to mention that even when, you know, IND has clarified that tomorrow we are not expecting rain of that intensity, you know, uh, we have uh, the water level continuously on rise in Yamuna River. In fact, uh, on uh, you know old uh, Yamuna Bridge, we have a water level close to the warning sign, and uh, there is a prediction that on 11th of July it can cross uh, the danger level mark. So at this point in time, you know we are seeing the visuals on one hand where we have water logging in the areas of the national capital. On the other hand, uh, you know ministers and in fact chief minister directing all the ministers to be uh, you know on ground and. Uh, help those who are in need and help the people uh, because, uh, you know, traffic congestion and all other problems are there. And also there is a danger related to, uh, you know, water level rise in Yamuna. Absolutely. Those visuals on your screen, ladies and gentlemen, the many parts of the national capital remain waterlogged. Now, Delhi Chief Minister Arvind Kejriwal has said that schools will remain closed tomorrow. You can see like there's a lot of inf infrastructure woes in the national capital. So many uh, regular streets have been waterlogged. The Khan market has been waterlogged where people, which has thrown a spanner in normal life where people trying to get from point A to point B, they're finding it very difficult because of the waterlogged roads over there. This becomes a huge threat when it comes to weak infrastructure where we saw that massive collapse in the uh, East Kailash area and also the threat of waterborne diseases uh, spreading in the national capital. We'll continue